Hello everyone, this is Cédric Chapas from up to You. If up to You is able to deliver such amazing feedback technology, it's thanks to a unique expert team which is working on acoustics, mechanics, materials, electronics, software to really put to an enriched level haptic feedback solutions. So how work up to You technology? So let's assume that uh, a cover glass a display, it's like a guitar rope. So what we do here is that we try to tune the mechanical behavior of the display versus the haptic properties of the display itself. Everything must be taken into account, the mechanical properties of the materials uh, and the, the way the display is embedded into uh, the, the casing of the smartphone, as an example, in order to really tune the working frequency and the mechanical amplitude of uh, the vibration on top of the display stack. How we deliver the uh, mechanical vibration to the display? So we are using what we call piezo actuators. So piezo actuators are electrical components which have the uh, capability to change the shape versus an electrical uh, uh, voltage which is applied to the actuator. Imagine the actuator which is bonded to the display. So if the shape of the actuator is changing, then the display is vibrating like a wave on top uh, of the sea. And this is exactly what is occurring on top of the display stack. So the main difference with inertial based solution is that you don't feel exactly the vibration because the, the amplitude of vibration is quite low in the range of one micrometer. So you can feel it directly. What you feel is the fact that the friction beneath your finger is changing in real time. So now imagine you are on the beach, you have a wave board and you are surfing on the wave. As long as there is water between your board and the sand, Everything is fine, you can slide on top of it. But if the water is removing, then your board is in contact with sand, roughness and friction is increasing, and then you are stopped. Changing the friction in a real time in the finger helps to reduce the friction, and then you can really stop the finger displacement. And this is how we provide texture rendering, slider, scroll wheel feedback, in a very interactive way on top of a display. So now you're really able to understand what's the difference between haptic technology and other solutions because we deliver really mechanical feedback below your finger and in order to give you a realistic haptic feedback when you touch a slider, move a slider, you really feel as it were a 3D one. So that's haptic technology. And remember, haptic is coming.